My name's Dominic. I'm 25, a filmmaker, and I didn't go to film school. First off, before we jump into this topic, I want to preface this video by saying I don't think college is necessarily a bad thing. Obviously, there are some degrees that you need to get in order to pursue certain careers, and I totally understand that. My argument for this video is for people going into creative fields, whether that be graphic design, photography, filmmaking. One question I get asked all the time is, what school did I go to? And it always surprises people when I tell them that I didn't go to school. In fact, I didn't even go to a high school. I was homeschooled throughout all my high school years. And after I graduated is when I started my video business. Granted, when I just started, I didn't really know what I was doing, and I didn't have a ton of content to sell to people in order to start making money. So as a graduation gift, my parents got me a Sony a6300. Once I had that camera in hand, I started shooting as much content as I could over the course of that first summer after I graduated. I brought that camera with me anywhere and everywhere just so I could shoot content and get really familiar with my camera and the camera settings and being able to adjust and shoot on the fly. With all that content, I captured that first summer I then put together a demo reel. After I made that first leap of just stepping out there and creating content, that's when people started to see my work. And so my argument for not going to film school starts with the fact that I've grown a successful video production business over the past decade and not once has anyone ever asked to see a college diploma. In fact, whenever I tell people that I didn't go to college, the most common response is good for you. Because of not going to school, I was able to save a lot of money and a lot of time. And in that time that I would have spent working on college classes and completing assignments, I was taking my camera, shooting content, getting connected with local businesses and other people to grow my network and build out my book of business. Granted, I had a great advantage because I was young, and I was still living at home, so I didn't rely on generating income through the business in order to survive. Now going to film school isn't all bad. One thing that a lot of my friends who went to film school had that I didn't was formal training by industry professionals. And it being in that environment of industry professionals, they also got connected with a whole network of people in the industry. So that's an area that I didn't really have going for me when I started my business and even four years in. But I will say I wouldn't trade those four years of work experience in exchange for college and the network that came with that. Because since that time, I've been able to develop a diverse network of creatives and professionals that generates work for me on a daily basis. So whenever someone comes up to me and they say, hey Dom, I wanna do what you do. What school should I go to? I always tell them that if you wanna do what I do, where I'm a jack of all trades and I produce full on videos for my clients as a one man band, then I tell them instead of spending 20, 30, $40,000 on film school that they should instead go out and purchase a modest camera and practice. A lot of people have asked, well, since you didn't go to college, how did you learn all the things that you know now? And I always tell them the same thing, YouTube University. When I was about 16, my family finally got unlimited internet in my house and I started binge watching Film Riot and Peter McKinnon and Maddie Hapoya and all the YouTube filmmaker and photographer content I could consume. I was hungry to learn more and I was ready to take the content that I was making to the next level. I think at the end of the day, when it comes to doing the type of work that I do and the type of work that thousands of other creators do, is do you have the drive? The only reason I am as successful as I am with my video career is not because talent, it's not because of my schooling, it's because I knew what kind of content I aspired to create and I pushed towards that goal every single day. So the question you need to ask yourself is, is this something that I really wanna do? And if it is and you're driven, no one's gonna stand in the way of your goals. So just to recap, College isn't bad if you want to go into filmmaking, but it's not necessarily for everyone. I know I wouldn't have done very well in school and I'm a much better hands-on learner. And because of that, I was able to take my filmmaking hobby and turn it into a career that generates over six figures a year. If you have any comments or opinions on this topic, I'd love to hear from you down in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button down below and smash that subscribe button if you want to stay up to date on future content. Also feel free to click the join button and check out my new memberships here on the channel. Once again, thank you so much for watching.
and I will catch you in the next one.